It's time to take in the best of Pongo's scenic waterway from the balcony of this contemporary five-room flat. This waterway is the combination of Pongo's beauty with a world-class mall, waterway point designed around it. Complete with an arched bridge and water fountains which turn on in the evenings, this mesmerizing view is exclusive only to a handful of units at waterway terraces too. Today, Home Central will be touring one such rare unit that has just come onto the market. But before we share with you the amazing features that makes Waterway Terraces 2 the award-winning icon of Pongo, let's take a look at the unit first. So here we are in this extremely private corner unit, which means that you'll have all the privacy that you want. The first thing that you see as you step in is this customized shoe cabinet, which is really good for feng shui. You will be pleased to know that no expense has been spared on renovation in this home and the highest quality of materials have been chosen to design this home, such as this vinyl flooring that is clad throughout the whole hall area. So on this side, there's also additional cabinetry and this design is actually a continuation from the shoe cabinet all the way to this minimalist TV feature wall and it's all in an earthy natural colour tone which is very nice and warms up the living area. There's also additional cabinets right down here which you can export to store whatever you want right here. So now in the living area, you can sit up to about 4 to 5 currently and there's still a lot of additional space so you can explore having a slightly bigger sofa set. And here we see the balcony which actually links us all the way to the bedroom from this study area. So the bedrooms we will explore in just a bit. Now let's take a look at this study area. So there's actually an option to enclose this space but the owners have decided to keep it open so that there's a nice organic flow from the study to the living and the bedrooms as well so that this space feels really spacious. And on this side, you'll see that there's also a Ubik power track system here. So this cute open shelving right here allows you to put your favourite books and even favourite photo frames of your moments with your family. And to tie up the whole living and dining area, we have ambient ceiling lighting that really adds a cosy ambience. So as we move further in here, we see the dining table. I actually personally find that this is a very good utilisation of this space. So what I really like about this kitchen is these glass panels and glass doors that have been used to separate the kitchen area from the living and dining area which allows it to feel really open and yet you can peek in through and look at the modern and beautiful design of the kitchen. So as we first step in, there is this um, large space here where you can store your refrigerator and also quality materials have been chosen like quality carpentry has been done and also this quality granite countertops. Over here there's an additional tabletop that allows for food preparation using the same um, warm wood tones in the rest of the kitchen cabinets, so very minimalist. And on this side there's also the Ubik power track system as well. And right behind me, of course, is the service yard. So now let's head into the rest of the uh, house to explore the bedrooms. Now onto our first common room. It's currently with a single size bed and feels really spacious. All bedroom floors are with parquet flooring and also come with built-in wardrobes that you'll see in every other bedroom. Currently in this room, there is a nice little sitting sofa right here, a one-seater that really adds a cosy touch to this space. Behind me is this balcony that links to the living and study area that we saw earlier on and shares the same highlights which is the scenic view right here. So a very nice place for you to just enjoy being in this room and having your own alone time. Now moving on to the other two rooms. Right before we enter, there is a toilet right here with an open shower area. So now moving on to the second room, you see that the size is roughly the same except this one doesn't connect to the balcony. And in this particular one, we see how it's been used as a study. So this is also with a single bed, as we said, parquet flooring and building wardrobes. So now to the master bedroom. 
So in this master bedroom, there is a toilet here as well. This is the master toilet with the same tile colours that's used in the common toilet as well. And it's slightly more spacious with also a tower area here that is covered with panel glass. As you can see, this master bedroom is really spacious and there's this beautiful L-shaped uh, wardrobe that has been really cleverly customised. On the inside, you'll uncover that there's actually windows for the aircon latch, but there's still optimised storage space for your clothes. And also a nice TV console right here that ties in with the whole design of the house in general and using very um, neutral colour tones throughout the whole home. And in this corner, there's this nice little dressing area which does not compromise on the space of the room. There's a mirror with shelvings at the back that are usable and also cabinets where you can store your little makeup and stuff. Now that we have toured this home, it's time to take a look around Waterway Terraces. There is much to love about waterway terraces and here are some of my few including the beautiful large courtyards at the centre of the development with distinctive landscaping that resembles that of botanical gardens which I really love including the roof terraces which offer scenic bird's eye view and basement condo-like parking that's super convenient. So with just a short walk, we have arrived at the Water Bay area and as you can see behind me, this is a really popular place to just chill and relax here. And this view can actually be enjoyed from the unit itself. On this side will be where you'll find Waterway Point and also Waterway which is a really good place for you to take scenic walks and jogs. And Safra is just an 8 minute stroll along the Waterway plus the upcoming Pongo Town Hub Library and Hawker Centre which is just 5 minutes walk away. So do expect massive upcoming transformation of the Pongo Digital District within the vicinity. If you wish to purchase this home, all the information is available in the description box down below. So do check that out. See you in our next video. Bye!